Hey, what's up guys? Super Miles Yo here for my 88th double eights episode of Breath of the Wild Master Mode. Now, it's been a little longer than I intended. Uh, it's been about two weeks. I skipped last weekend. I don't remember what was... Well, I do remember what was going on. I can talk about that. I meant to talk about it last week, but I didn't. Anyways, we're back, guys. We're back. And here's the truth, guys. I'm... In the last episode, we did our second session of Central Tower Seeds. Say that five times fast. Um, and today we're going to continue. Here's the thing, guys. We have 437 seeds. I believe the final count is going to be 459, maybe? We'll double check when we fast travel. But the point is, we are getting close, but... There's about 20 left that we need, and I have not counted 20 left on the map that I can see right now. So, which means there's a good chance that I missed like at least five or 10, which is very disheartening. So that's kind of the thing here is, let me level with you guys. We are definitely nearing the end of this entire playthrough. Wah, 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 it's, it, it's, um, it actually is a little sad, but we are. And that's the way it is. But at this point, I can't really say definitively how close we are. Like, uh, this could be like our f third episode to the end. It could be the fourth or fifth episode to the end. I doubt it. But honestly, it's just a matter of how long is it going to take me to, you know, track down these last couple seeds. Because we are sure as hell not going to quit now <laughs> since we are so dang close. Uh, but, you know that's going to be a, up in the air so we'll see about that but I would assume we're somewhere around like 3 or 4 from the end right now which is pretty crazy um, anyways um, yeah so last weekend what was going on I Friday night well today Saturday night usually Friday I've stopped doing it Friday night because like I'm always like exhausted because I'm usually working Friday nights this one in here and then uh, once I get back home, I just want to, like, just veg out and then chill. Even though this is basically vegging out, I just don't have the energy to, to commit to that. So I usually do it Saturday night, but then Saturday, this is a whole fun story. I had a balloon gig. Might have mentioned that in the last episode, I don't remember. But I did have a balloon gig, and uh, it, was a, it was absolutely a smashing success, but let's get to that in a minute. Uh, it's my first one I had in a while. It's my first one in years that I've had on Halloween because I always did the trunk or treat thing. For a couple years I've done it. This year uh, I was invited again to do that. And it's been the first year they had it in a, in a while. So I did take them up on that. It was a three-hour gig that I was signing up for. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, about a week beforehand I ordered, I ordered my balloons. That's usually what I do, and it said, like, I don't have Prime or anything, but it still said, like, hey, these will be here, like, in maybe five days. And actually, I ordered it, like, a week and a half in advance, I think. I don't remember exactly, but it it was supposed to arrive with, like, three or four days. Oop. What the? I don't know what that was. It was supposed to arrive three or four days in advance, right? Like, it's supposed to arrive Thursday or, I think, Thursday. The gig was Saturday, so I thought I had plenty of time. Um, I wasn't out of balloons or anything, but I was definitely running low, and a lot lower than I wanted to be on certain colors. I had no reds, I had very little oranges, which was a problem because I knew I'd be making a lot of pumpkins and such. So I ordered two bags more. Long story short, my order got delayed. The one time, like the one time that I need Amazon to deliver my crap on time is the time that's late. Every other time I place an order that like doesn't even really matter, it's always early. It's like, hey, surprise, like, your package is being delivered three days early. And I'm like, oh, great. I mean, thanks. But, you know, didn't really need that. And then the one time I need it in a timely manner, it gets delayed. So at first it was, oh, that really sucked. What the heck? Yeah, and also the one time I need Link to die if he doesn't do it. Um, so there you go. And I still missed. God damn it. Um, they were supposed to come Thursday, then it said Friday. And I was like, alright, that's cutting it close, but sure. 
Friday night rolls around. They said, ooh, whoops, we're awful sorry, but they're still not here, so they're going to be delayed even more. And it was like, it might be anywhere from tomorrow to, like, next Tuesday. And I was like, oh, crap. Like, this is not good. Like, I, w I just did not want to do a gig where I had to constantly be like, oh, whoops, we're out of this color. You know? Like, this was unprofessional. I, it was... It would have disappointed the kids, and I'm not all about that. You know how, you know, you know me. Uh, so I was really nervous about that. So what I ended up doing is I went to Party City with Kendall. I drove all the way there, like 20 minutes away, whatever. It's in Brentwood. Drove to Party City, and I bought like $20 worth of the cheap crap, like cheap balloons, like not the worst you can buy, but far from the best, like the chalky. Uh, flimsy they were honestly smaller too not great balloons but I was like you know what if it's this or nothing I'll, I'll do this just in, just you know I was still hoping that they would come in time and what do you know as soon as I walk out of the party city as soon as I walk out with my fresh new crap balloons I get a call from my mom I think it was Josie Josie was like hey your balloons are here and I was like Anyways, well, I spent twenty dollars on need, but actually, I did, I did use quite a bit of the cheapo ones, just because uh, I I went through a lot of balloons. That's another thing. That's why it was such a success, and it's a good thing that I bought those balloons as well. Oh no! Please tell me if there's another rusty shield nearby, because I am not. Unless I just happen to have one, that would be really silly. No, I don't. Okay, but they've got to put one nearby, right? And the tracker won't really work because those are already there. I actually think I remember this one, unless there was another one like this. I remember this crap. Ugh, I might turn on the tracker in a second, even though it will be confounded by the other rusty shields over there. What are you? Oh, you're another seed. That's fun. Wow, alright, well, found that on accident. Now we need a rusty shield. Oh, we're getting so close, guys. I'm gonna have to fast travel just so I can see the total count. I wish there was a, a way you could see that. I just don't think there is. Anyways, yeah, so I was talking about the, um, the, uh, yeah, so the balloons. For the first, like, I would say hour, this gig was, like, pretty slow, and I was actually starting to get a little nervous, not, well, you know, it would have been fine either way, but, I don't know, I, I would have liked it to be busy, and I was thinking, like, oh, I want it to be busy. Like, I don't want it to look like I'm just doing nothing and getting paid a ton for doing nothing. I just felt bad, you know? Ah, here we go. Perfect. Um, so I was like, I hope it picks up. Turns out there was another trunk or treat at the church right next to us at the exact same time. And there was, like, so many kids over there. Susie said, like, oh, there's 200 kids over there. I doubt it was 200. I honestly don't. It could have been, though. I don't know. But she tends to inflate those things. Um, it was a lot of kids, though. I would say, I mean, definitely at least a hundred. Maybe it was multiple hundreds. I don't know. Maybe, like, total over the course of the day. But at around, the gig was, I think, four to seven. At about maybe 4.45, maybe 5.15 at the latest, it was like the floodgates opened and... Like, 50 kids at once were all of a sudden right in front of me in my in the line to get a balloon. And that line did not stop until, like, 6.45. Crazy. Like, and then, like, right at 7 when it ended, the line was basically dying down, and all the kids that were left, like, I just made them quick balloons, and then they, they skedaddled. Like, that's when it finally started to die down, but like at least two hours two and a half hours straight of non-stop balloonage and you know what like i said 
I preferred that, you know, I was like, I want it to look like I'm busy and doing my job and, you know, earning my, 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 what's it called, my keep. And I certainly believe I did that. Um, it was, it was a lot of fun, you know, it was definitely a lot, but that was, it was good, you know, I, I did have a balloon gig in April and that was, that was pretty successful as well. Um, I mean, it wasn't even that insane as this one was, but it was still, there we go. I hate the acorn ones. Oh, I missed. But, um, come on. This one was uh, just another level, and it was good to be back doing that, knowing that it was, it was still a success. And here's the real kicker. Well, there's a couple kickers. So, not in a bad way. Okay, that sounds negative. Good kickers. Yay, kickers. So, of course, I, my rate is like usually 60 an hour. So that's what I said. That's what I kept it at. And I was like, you know, 60 an hour. So it was three hours. So $180, just my pay to be there. And I, I didn't really realize this. I figured it was the church paying me, but it's actually Tom and Dot, my great aunt and uncle themselves, which is cool. Um, so it wasn't the church itself, which I didn't realize, but it doesn't really make much of a difference. So I got that. Then, like, right towards the end, when there's about ten minutes left, some random lady just was like, here, yeah, I want you to take this. And she, like, puts a $20 bill in my freaking balloon box. And I was like, dude, no way, that's crazy. Like, I basically, she left before I could, like, protest. And be like, no, no, it's fine, you keep that. I thought it was like a one or maybe a five, actually. Um, so I didn't think much of it. And then as we were leaving, I was like, Jesus Christ, that's a 20. What the heck? So already, so $200 right there. Pretty insane. Then a week, like a couple days go by, and I get word that like, oh, everybody's raving about those balloons. Uh, like they all loved it. Um, oh, come on, hold on. All right, I gotta make sure that I actually got all these. Oh, okay, yes, I did. I, I could I, I knew, like, could have sworn that I did, but for a second it looked like there was one that I, oh, wait a minute. No, wait. seeing is one that I might have missed in this area. The King's Study. Am I missing one? Let me see. There is... That's two in the Sanctum. And then there's one... Oh, okay, I do have it. It was just hiding. All right. All right. Well, see, this is what I mean. It's like, where are the seeds that I'm missing? So I've gotten all these. Let me see. The next, okay, we're going to do some fast travel in a second, so I'm sure I will quickly see how many I have total. I got those two. Goodness. Where are the seeds that I'm missing? Mount oh, Gustav. I got... I got that. Yeah. The river one. Just around the river bend. Just around my big rear end. Um, I guess we need to go to Giants Forest. Let me see. Yeah, we got that. Temple ruins. Sage temple ruins. Right there. Oh my goodness, guys. This is the problem. This is the problem. Wait, wait, wait. Mount Daphnis. Yes, I did get that one. This is what I'm talking about. I don't see any other ones. Oh, okay, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna flip the map. I'm gonna make sure... We're gonna see. Yeah, okay. There are a couple on this side of Central Tower that I may not have gotten, so let's check that out, okay? 
Ah, yes, here we go. So, okay, got those two. There's one here. Dig Dog Suspension Bridge. Looks like there's one here, here. Oh, it's pretty late or early <laughs> okay Manhala Mon Bridge Regencia River ah yep there's another one here and I already got this one okay oh boy <laughs> we're, we're getting getting to the end here so we got five on the map. Let me warp. Well, let's, why not? Let's warp here and see how many we got. Oh, I forgot I had a lime plus watermelon. Aha, drink. 886. Okay, dang. Yeah, so unless I'm just totally missing something. Well, get these five, we'll have 891. That's still nine that I have no idea where they are. This is the problem. It could be anywhere. Oh my god. Ugh. I mean, that's still a pretty good success rate, honestly, if you think about it. It's like nine, that's one out of 100. So that means like I got 99% of them. A little quick math for you. But still, that ain't enough. Like, I knew I would miss some. But I figured it would maybe be one or two or three, not nine. Yeah, that's... The good news is, though, that's only, like, two batches, right? So, like, I find five of them, and I mark them all, and then we can go get those. And then, like, I, I can I can maybe... Mm, I can maybe locate them before an episode and then just film me getting them. Like the last seeds. It's the final seeds. There was one on... No. Floria Bridge, I want to say. That I just... I did get it. Okay. Because I saw Kendall playing through. She was like in the Floria... Oh, am I gonna get back up? Ugh. I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna warp here. Wait, is that even. I feel like that's also underneath. Dang it. Maybe I'll just drown. But I saw like a pinwheel on the Floria Bridge, and I was like, I don't remember getting that one, but it turns out I did. That's what I'm saying, guys. Like, how could I miss one? I was so thorough. He's the at, but clearly not thorough enough. Yeah, I'm not gonna make it. Oh well. Excuse me. All right, green time. Let me try my uh, trusty, dusty, standing B-I-L. Oh, that was, that was a lag stop right there, if I've ever seen one. Let me try that again. Maybe it's because there's so many particulates in the air. Too much for the game to handle. Oh, you butter boy. What? I don't even know what that was, man. Don't even know what that was. You're gay. How'd that not insta-kill you? Alright, goodbye. I'm done here.
This is probably not even going to work because it's raining, which means it's going to lag stop. Oh, what? Why was I on square bombs? Or was I? Link, I swear to freaking Jesus. That was the worst, dude. That was the worst. Why did you ragdoll so? Oh, Quickie. Poor Quickie. I don't know where this one is. Oh, no. Dang it. I hate these. It's another rock throwing bullshit. Oh, maybe this isn't as bad as it looks. Okay, yeah, this is pretty easy. I thought we had to throw it from way up there. Oh. Let's try. Sorry. She snores. I uh, got that. Let's go up here. Oh, guys, where are the seeds? Hmm. That's so silly. That is so, so silly. I don't know why. I feel like there might be in the Garud over the Wasteland region, because I feel like I might have... I don't know. I feel like if they're if anywhere, they've got to be there. Because there's just a lot of winding, weird cliffs, places. I feel like it was easy for me to skip over one. Or, like, maybe, uh, one of, the, one of the earlier ones I did, like Akala or Lanayru, just because, like, I wasn't... I'm, I'm assuming, like, I got better as I went along, so maybe the first couple ones I wasn't being as careful. Get out of here. I hate them. Yeah. Oh, okay, I need another bow. Have another duplex, there we go. Oh, it's a mage. It's a mage. He's dead. Oh, not yet. Bonk. Oh, you're still not dead, huh? Goodbye. Uh. Oh yeah, there was one here. But you're in the tree, in the tree. Yup. Yeah, ha ha. Oh my god, we're so close. So it is, yeah, it is 4.59. So once we get these two, we'll have 4.50. Insanity. It's so funny watching back through my playthrough even like a couple months ago because I kept saying over and over oh I'm never gonna 100% this game like that's just off the table you know that's out of the question that's where I draw the line and then I slowly transformed into well you know maybe I could we'll see maybe one day maybe it'll take me a couple years to do it but maybe I could do it and look at us now we're about to do it these past couple months have flown by crazy fast though like I started this new phase like back in June and uh, maybe July. I think it was June though. 890. Ugh, oh, so close. And um, so, you know. But now it's like almost November. That's always what happens with me. It's like the last half of the year just completely disappears. It's crazy. I mean, honestly, time is flying so fast in general now. Like, this whole year has gone by so fast. But, yeah. Because in a way, I kind of see August as, like, the beginning of the year in a way. Because obviously, you know, school and stuff. But January is, like, technically the beginning of the year. So it, it's always very strange. But So to me, like, the year has just started, like, the school year, really. 
but you know if I think about it in terms of like New Year's then it 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 does feel like it's been a minute but still like I think back to specific points in like January February and I'm like that seems like yesterday you know but it wouldn't oh boy all right this crap again I don't think this is gonna make it nope maybe if I onus that's my little shorthand for cryonis. Ooh. Close. I love coffee. I love tea. I love the java java and it loves me. Oh no, I'm gonna run out of rocks. I heard a stall. Yes, I got it. Boston beans. So I beans. I'm so low on arrows, man. Dang, I never miss. Well, except for that. Yeah, just don't say things like that, because then you'll miss. But, the, seriously, the stall moblins, their heads are, like, so easy to shoot. They must have just given them a huge hitbox, because, you know, it's crazy. Alright guys, this is where I just totally break down into tears, because I don't know what to do anymore. We'll probably, I'll give it like maybe 5-10 minutes, I'll try and search, and if I don't, if I come up totally empty, then I will have to um, end it off, and I'll, I'll take some time, whenever, probably next weekend, to like look through the map, try and pinpoint some of these that I missed. Because at this point, I think we've just about finished Central Tower. So at this point, the name of the game is going to be... <laughs> God. The name of the game is going to be just looking at the map in front of me. And comparing it... <laughs> comparing it to the end game map to see if I missed anything and I'll just hope and pray because they were kind enough to not give us a single indicator in game where the Korok seeds that you missed are except for the freaking mask which only vibrates when you're like right next to it so what freaking good is it nothing that's what. It's nothing good. Mm. You know what, guys? This this just it requires. This is gonna require some patience and dedication, um, which I do not feel like I have right now. And I'm like drifting off into Neverland, so might have to end this one a little bit short. It's almost 30 minutes, not too bad, but yeah, my hope, how many pins do I have? I have six left. Okay, perfect. That should be enough. So we've got five stamps left, and then five pins. That, that'll be enough to mark all the ones that I don't currently have. I've never been to this skull. How did that happen? Um... Look at this map, though. Look at that map. That is wild. But, yeah. So, I am I think, guys, this is... I'm confidently going to say now that this has been our third to last episode of this playthrough. How is that? 98.45% done. We are getting so dang close. And uh, I reckon... The next episode we will be able to finish up, get all the remaining seeds if I can manage to find them, and Hestu's gift. And then in our finale finale, we'll fight the boss again, and that'll be it. Hope you're looking forward to it. Should be another maybe two weeks if I keep my track of one per week. Just, you know, spread it out nice and nice and good. So I guess I'll see you next weekend, y'all. Peace out.